kingdom fungi these are usually heterotrophic organisms and as they develop on decaying or dead they are also known as saprophytes or parasitic organisms they show diverse morphology that is the orange the rotting orange which we have seen is also fungi and the mushroom you eat is also fungi as well as wheat rust is also a fungi and yeast which is used in making cakes beer is also fungi and we also get antibiotics from fungi exception is the yeast which is unicellular otherwise all the fungi are filamentous having long cylinder body and they have got a thread like structure known as hyphae and the network of this hyphae is known as mycelium they re they reproduce by three methods that is vegetative propagation asexual that is formation of conidia etc and sexual method that is formation of oospores zoospores etc let us understand the sexual reproduction it involves three phases first phase is plasmogamy in which the protoplasm of motile or non motile gamete is fused second stage is karyogamy in which the two nuclei they fuse and then meiosis takes place in zygote giving us haploid spores the differentiation or the classification under this kingdom is done on the basis of morphology of mycelium mode of spore, spore formation as well as mode of formation of fruiting bodies so upon this basis they have been classified into phycomycetes ascomycetes basidomycetes and deuteromycetes <coughs> let us understand these one by one in phycomycetes these are found in aquatic habitats usually free flowing they reproduce asexually by the formation of zoospores they their mycelium is aseptate next is ascomycetes these are also known as sac fungi they are multicellular their mycelium is branched and septate they produce asexually by conidia formation and they are saprophytic in nature next is basidomycetes mushrooms which we eat is basidomycetes they are also known as puff balls they grow in soil on trees and inside or on the parasite uh, as a parasite on host body their mycelium is branched and septate and they reproduce by vegetative propagation by the process of fragmentation next is deuteromycetes these are also known as imperfect fungi because their vegetative and asexual form is known but when their sexual form is observed it is believed that once they grow further they get into their original class to which they belong that is once they overcome this stage and goes to the next stage they go to either basidomycetes or ascomycetes their mycelium is septate plus branch and they only and only reproduce asexually through conidia formation so this is kingdom fungi we have done the classification on the basis of morphology of mycelium mode of spore for spore formation and fruiting bodies as well as we have learned here that fungi show diverse morphology they are saprophytic heterotrophic in nature yeast is the only exception being unicellular otherwise they are filamentous having long cylinder body and thread like structure known as hyphae